Take out Brilliance 48 degree and cord. Connect the cord. Remove the protective cap of lens. Check the exposed distance of the threads between the objective barrels. Make the thread distance exposed on the left and right sides basically the same. If not, please rotate the knob on the front of the objective lens barrel until same. Push this middle part back to an angle where it cannot be turned. Determine dentist's approximate PD. Hold the single-sided prism housing with one hand. Flip up the lens barrel slightly so that the metal edge of the eyepiece barrel is slightly away from the lens. This operation can prevent scratching the lens. Adjust the left and right PD knobs for simple PD adjustment. Adjust the PD to the approximate position. Normally, the left and right distances should be symmetrical. Hold the prism housing in the middle again. Rotate the brilliance 48 degree until the edge of the eyepiece tube is as close to the goggle lens as possible. Push the slider up and down to adjust the approximate pupil height. Generally, the center of the eyepiece tube is slightly above the middle of the goggle lens. Put on brilliance 48 degrees and adjust to a comfortable position. If it does not fit the bridge of the nose, please slightly adjust the nose pads. It is recommended to adjust at the optical shop. Fasten the cord to prevent slipping. Close your right eye, keep upright, and find an object at a suitable distance. Move your head to an appropriate distance to see objects clearly. Rotate the left PD adjustment knob to adjust the left PD until the left eye has a clear and complete circular field of vision and make sure that there are no shadows on the left and right. At the same time determine whether there is a shadow above and below. If there are shadows above and below, push the pupil height adjustment slider to adjust the pupil height until there is no shadow above and below the field of view. If there are still shadows up and down after adjusting the pupil height, turn the whole lens barrel slightly until there are no shadows up and down. Then the field of view integrity adjustment of left eye is completed. Close the left eye, turn the right PD adjustment knob to adjust the right PD. Repeat the above steps to complete the right eye adjustment. After two eyes have obtained a complete circular field of view, Please keep seeing objects at a suitable working distance, clearly. Then adjust the precise PD and start to combine images until the two circular fields of view merge into one oval field of view. If the vision of the dentist's left and right eyes is different and has not been corrected by myopia, one can see clearly by left eye, but cannot by right eye. You can keep the position where the left eye sees clearly. Then hold the right objective lens and rotate it back and forth to adjust the focus until you can see clearly by right eye. One can see clearly by right eye, but cannot by left eye, repeat the corresponding steps above. The more the objective lens barrel is rotated toward the object, the closer the working distance will be, and the magnification will increase. On the contrary, the farther the working distance is, the smaller the magnification will be. Please choose the distance that suits your arm length. After the adjustment is completed, you can maintain an upright posture for surgery.